think the website is incredibly intuitive to use. The map functionality is really um, stripped back uh, and allows you to really see the assets in a very clear, user-friendly way. I find the platform quite intuitive. Um, it's good the way it links with the map. It saves us time in the administration, um, registering our assets. Um, we really love the way that we can bring assets into the market more easily because of what PicoFlex provides. We provide uh, behind the meter assets for, um, from commercial premises uh, for the DNO um, and SO markets. So we use electrical vehicles. Um, we let EVs charge when uh, it's best for the grid, best for the consumer, and best for the environment. Our assets are predominantly energy from waste plants, so steam turbines and landfill gas generation. What we really need is more people to just be getting involved. So we've recognised that one of the, the key factors to people not being able to participate um, is price and another one is location. So in terms of price, we've published all of our ceiling prices. So we do that for each window. So for each winter, summer period, um, for at least a year in advance so that you can see what values are available. And we've also provided on our website a, um, a cost calculator, which acts as a bit of a ready reckoner for you to work out whether your bid is under or below that guide price or not. And then in terms of location, we've recently produced our network development plan. So this is a, a regulatory requirement, but it's published on our website and it gives an indication of all the substations that are going to require some kind of intervention within the next zero to two, so that'll be in our current tender, three to five, or five to ten years. I'm most excited about the shift to closer to real-time markets. I think that gives us an opportunity to be way more precise about what flexibility we need, where and when. I think it makes it easier for flexibility like uh, charge points that can be flexible when they charge to participate. And lastly, I think it gives market participants a much better opportunity to coordinate actions for local requirements with national balancing requirements. So we're under contract with uh, UKPN as well as um, Scottish Power Energy Networks, um, and we're, uh, we're live trading. Uh, we've got fully automated trades, um, so um, it's working very well for us. So we recently signed contracts with the Scottish Power Energy Networks and we also have contracts with UKPN and just this month have started Project Leo with Oxfordshire and SSEN, um, so yeah, doing lots.